Greetings, Cyberdogs! This is Randog coming at you from the Wizard's Tower in this Let's Play Minecraft 1.3 Survival Series! And in the previous episode, we were preparing ourselves for our very first 1.3 adventure. And in this episode, we are going to be enchanting our diamond pickaxe and venturing forth past the graveyard to see if we can render some new 1.3 chunks and get some of the new 1.3 jazz up in our beers nest. And oh man, guys, am I excited because this is the first time that we have enchanted anything in the series. And this is the first time that I personally have ever enchanted anything in Minecraft. So um, that is freaking exciting stuff, man. I'm just going to, I'm going to chomp on a, on a steak though, before we get busy. Um, there we go. Mm -mm. Now, a lot of you guys have told me that, um, that a bookshelf should not be touching the enchanting table and that these torches are actually going to um, lessen the effect of the bookshelves around the enchanting table. So um, I'm just going to remove all of that jazz. And now you can see the enchanting table is working at full freaking blast. So let's do this, guys. The first bit of enchanting in this Let's Play Minecraft series. And I am freaking over the moon. Oh, my goodness. I, hopefully our pickaxe is going to end up being the sweetest of the sweet. Um, all right, let's do this. So let's see. How does this work? Okay, so we've got um, our enchanting block here. So let us put in the pickaxe right so we've got a, a 30 and a 13 and a 3 okay so i need 30 experience to get the 30 right so we can't get the 30 so if we how do we make new ones okay so we just do it like this um oh man well there was a 15 there was a 15 so 15 is as high as we've gone so far um 30 is is as high as we can go but we don't have 30 xp at the moment okay 16 16 is looking good um let's see if we can get higher than 16 17 okay mm. um can we get higher than 17 19 oh my god missed it um okay there's a 19 i'm, I'm gonna take a 19 guys i'm gonna take a 19 man how sweet does this look okay let's do it man kablam efficiency three I have no idea what that means, but it sounds freaking sweet. Let's look what it looks like. Oh, look at my freaking pickaxe glowing. Oh my God, that is, all oh, oops, my bad. <laughs> oh man, my pickaxe is glowing now. That is so sweet. Okay, I don't know what efficiency three does, but um, I guess it's cool. I guess efficiency means um, it breaks blocks quicker because it's more efficient, right? So that is awesome. Um, so we're gonna be breaking three blocks much quicker than normal, which is really awesome. Um, right, guys, I just want to put down a whole bunch of the stuff that we picked up um, on our when we were adventuring. And I just want to make sure that I've got everything that I need. Right, we actually do need a few more torches before we go on our 1.3 adventure. Um, and we need to bring our map also. So, torches away. How, we get, how many are we going to make, man? We probably need more than that. Oh man, I'm so freaking excited to get this adventure underway. OMG, people. This is so sweet. I can't believe 1.3 is already upon us, man. It feels like it took forever. Um, but it is here and it is happening. Mm. Right, so I've got my crafting table, compass. Um, I've got the map going. I've got some bread and a steak. I probably need more, more food, I would think. I got a I got a chicken leg over there. Um, let's see. Is there any other food in here? I mean, that is quite a lot of bread, but oh, we got a whole bunch of melons. Sweet. <laughs> okay, we certainly have enough um, stuff to get our adventure underway now. I think. Let's drop off that coal, and um, we don't need anything else. We've got a bucket of water. So, all right, guys, we are heading off in freaking adventure mode time, baby. We are heading into the unknown and um, who knows what we're gonna find my mission is to find some new 1.3 chunks guys and to render some new freaking um, awesome 1.3 loose and um, when we get back to the mole hole after our 1.3 adventure we're gonna be doing a whole bunch of it's gonna basically gonna be a fixing up um, session we will spend three or four um, episodes fixing everything that needs to be fixed in the mole hole but for now we are heading out to the graveyard with our new enchanted pickaxe how sweet is this pickaxe check it out man Damn! Oh, that is awesome. I'm so excited. Um, right. So we've got... Let's see. Just make sure our loot is okay. We've got pickaxes, spades, 
an iron axe if we need, a sword, a bow with some arrows. We've got torches, food, the map, dirt, ladders, a water bucket, arrows, crafting table and compass, man. That is all we need to go on our adventure. Um, in the previous adventure, we used... Because we went to a second continent, we used um, pillars to find our way back. But in this adventure, we're just going to use our compass because the compass basically points us straight back to um, to the spawn, which is very close to the mole hole. And, and when w once we start heading back, we're going to be able to quite easily see what is that over there? Oh, that was a sheep. Um, we're going to quite easily see the mole hole and you know the the giant lava ball and all that stuff. So, um, man, we are heading in this direction. Mm. This is awesome, man. First freaking adventure in a long ass time. We've been doing a whole bunch of crafting in the series so far, and um, it is time to render some new chunks, people. Um, right, so we are just going to be heading in this direction. Um, right, let's check our map. Okay, so I don't know where, are we that white dot over there? I think so. So we're just gonna we're just gonna carry on going this way, see what happens. Um, we are in a jungle, so we might spawn a, a jungle temple. If there was a jungle temple around here, that would be the most amazing freaking thing ever. Um, but that I think that we're gonna have to get really lucky because I think we're still in the um, in the first chunk, right? Oh my God! Look how quickly this pickaxe breaks stuff. Efficiency three, baby, man. I can't wait to find a cave or something, man. We're just going to hack through stuff like it's no one's business. But for now, I think I'm just going to equip my sword. I don't want to waste my sweet-ass pickaxe. Um, all right, guys. So, we are just going to be heading in this direction. Let's see if we can... S Ooh. New biome. New chunk. New freaking chunk. Spawn your bastard. And give us something sweet. Well, it is. it is generating... The chunk is generated. But it looks like it's another tundra. Let's have a look at our map. Oh, look. The map is actually upside down, it seems. We are heading south at the moment, right? You see that? We are heading south. Oh, there's another jungle biome, people. There is another jungle biome. That means that we might be generating... Holy crap, what is that? What is that? Is this a cocoa bean? Oh my god. How do we how do we harvest this? Oh my god, that is awesome. Cocoa beans! Oh dudes, so awesome. So we have actually just rendered a new jungle, right? So this means that this is a 1.3 chunk right here. Um so let's just make sure that there are no jungle temples in this new jungle that we have just rendered because this is what we're after, man. We are after 1.3 jazz. And we just got 1.3 jazz. We just got cocoa beans. Um, I have no idea what cocoa beans do, actually. In my excitement, I, I just realized that I have no idea what a cocoa bean does. What's that over there? Is that another cocoa bean? Dudes, this is crazy, man. We are, we are freaking all over this 1.3. We are lucky as hell. I'm sure I saw... What? What the heck? Orange? Oh man, that is sweet. Cocoa beans galore. Hmm. Okay, so maybe they're not maybe they're not as rare as I think they are. So there seem to be quite a lot of cocoa beans um, spawning. I I thought that they might be rarer, but look, they're they're all different colours and stuff, which is really cool. Um, this is kind of cool that we've we've spawned in another. Well, we've we have rendered another jungle biome. I mean, this is good news for the chances of a jungle temple, is it not, my friends? Um, let's see. Wow. It is pretty big. We're just gonna carry on going through this jungle, man. Hopefully, we find something sweet, um, and then it, and then if not, hopefully we spawn a desert biome. Oh, <laughs> check it that it's a desert biome. <laughs> awesome. Man, we are we are getting lucky today. Um, right. Well, I don't see any jungle uh, jungle temples around here, but I'm I'm pretty sure what's going to happen is one of you guys is going to spot a jungle uh, a jungle temple that I didn't see 
because you're going to see it through the, the trees or something because you guys are freaking crazy awesome with those eyes. And um, I'm going to feel like an idiot. But I don't see any jungle temples here. So I think I want to head into the desert because, um, man, how awesome is this place? Look at this. This is so sweet. What the hell is going on over there? What? Are those brown leaves? What? Hmm. That's weird. Man, this is sweet. Okay, there is more jungle over here. So before we before we head into the desert, let's just make sure that this um, this jungle doesn't have e like literally doesn't have anything. Doesn't have any, any freaking temples in it. Man, my Minecraft is lagging like gray gray. And it's either lagging because there's a jungle temple up in here. Or it's lagging because my computer is, is rubbish. Oh my goodness gracious, it is almost night time. Um, didn't think about that. <laughs> yeah, did not think about the fact that it's going to be night time soon. Um... That's not good. I mean, maybe what I need to do is head into um, into a cave system or something. You know, cave systems are much much easier to manage at night than um, the open. Man, there are a lot of cocoa beans up in this business. But now that I've got some, surely I can plant some or something. What is going on up there, man? Check some weird... Oh, okay. It's just the top of trees. Are there any temples? Do temples have light? Ouch. Because if they do have light, then it's going to be pretty easy to spot them, I think. Man, shit is getting dangerous now, guys. Excuse my French. But I think what we're going to try and do is stay on top of the, um, the treetops, right? Because that gives us a pretty good view of what's going on. Hoot! Oh, Lord. I need to eat. Man, I should have brought me some steaks. Alright, I'm going to stay up here. Where it's relatively safe. Okay, so here is a mountain. And pumpkin, uh, pumpkins down there. That is awesome. So this is a mountain biome, people. This is where emeralds are. Um, we needed a mountain biome to spawn emeralds. So this is good news. Is that, an, is that an entrance to a cave or is that just... Okay, so we found at least a mountain biome where we could find emeralds. But um, I don't know if emeralds are exactly what we're after at the moment. Um, could be actually. Maybe we should. Maybe we should try. Is there any way down here without without freaking dying? Here's some vans. Ooh, Ooh my lord, that was close to death. Man, if I die, I'm gonna freaking rage quit life. Okay, this is actually a cave entrance right of uh, right in here. Um, so we are gonna be heading in this direction, people. Oh yes. And, man, efficiency three pickaxe for the win. The, the time it takes to, like, break stuff is just diminished so much. Um, right, let's just hide from these guys. Actually, let's look at our map. What's that? Do you see that, guys? It's like, great there, 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 where my cursor is. Is that a temple? I think that could be a freaking temple, people. But we got some we got some enemies to deal with up in here. Oh man. This is awesome guys. This is such a freaking sweet adventure. Um and I'm so happy with my pickaxe. Look at this, man. Look how fast it breaks it breaks coal in, in one hit, which is really amazing. Oh my lord! Haha, <laughs> 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 you missed. <laughs> Alright. Let's head in this direction, guys. We're not actually gonna uh whoa. Oh, we, we can't actually head in this direction. Wow, that's a lot of cows. Look how many cows that is. 
Guys, there is some seriously weird stuff going on up in here, man. I'm at the top of a freaking cliff somewhere in the middle of Minecraft 1.3. No idea where I am. Um, but I'm going to have to end this episode here, I'm afraid, my friends, because it is, I'm running out of hard drive space and I've got <laughs> to end this episode. But in the next episode, we're going to continue on our 1.3 adventure, see if we can find any new 1.3 loots. So far, we have found some cocoa beans, which is sweet, guys. And um, man, it has been fun. If you've enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. This is Rendog, who has been playing Minecraft 1.3 Survival. We'll see you in the next episode, guys. And don't forget to visit dogcraft.net, my friends. See you in the next episode, guys. Good freaking bye. Bye-bye, 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 bye-bye.